a compendium of the book of Joshua. The author is Joshua. The theme, Conquering Canaan. Date of writing, 14th century B.C. Joshua records in part the military campaign wages by Joshua in conquering the promised land and concludes with detailed instructions for the division of the land among the tribes. It is the first book to bear the name of its principal character. As a young man, Joshua served in the tabernacle, Exodus 33, verse 11. He and Caleb were the two among the 12 spies who brought back a favorable report. Numbers 14, verse 6 through chapter 9, verse 30. Toward the end of the wanderings, Moses was divinely led to appoint Joshua as his successor, as a man in whom is the Spirit. According to Numbers 27, verse 18 through 23. Deuteronomy chapter 1, verse 38. Who had with Caleb. Woolly followed the Lord, according to Numbers chapter 32 and verse 12. Israel entered Palestine with a promise of the land, the presence of the Lord, the law of the Lord, and the leadership of Joshua. With all this, they should have been successful everywhere. But disobedience led to defeat. The events recorded here may cover as many as 30 years. The book illustrates the principles that the child of God will be involved in conflict with evil powers and with Satan himself if he earnestly undertakes to possess all that God has promised to him on this earth. According to Ephesians chapter 1, verse 3, chapter 6, verse 8 through 18, Joshua presents several types rich in meaning. The Passover, according to chapter 5, verse 10. The city of refuge, Joshua chapter 20, verse 5. The outline of this book is seen in five divisions. The preparation for entering Palestine, the conquest of the land, the allocation of territory to the tribes, Joshua's final message, and his death. Number one, the preparation for entering Palestine. Moses succeeded by Joshua. Chapter 1, verse 1 through 18. Rehab assistance chapter 2 verse 1 through 24 crossing the Jordan chapter 3 verse 1 through chapter 4 verse 24 a new generation circumcised chapter 5 verse 1 through 15 second division the conquest of the land Conquest of Jericho, chapter 6, verse 1 through 27. Achan's sin and Israel's experience at Ai, chapter 7, verse 1 through chapter 8, verse 35. Experienced at Gideon, chapter 9, 
verse 1 through chapter 10, verse 15. Victory at Malachi and other southern cities. Chapter 10, verse 16 through 43. The Northern Philistines Campaign, chapter 11, verse 1 through 23. The Roaster of a Conquered King, chapter 12, verse 1 through 24. Third outline, just allocation of the territory to the tribes, chapter 13, verse 1 through chapter 22, verse 34. Joshua's final message, chapter 1 through chapter 24, verse 32, and Joshua's death, chapter 24, verse 34. What I love about this book, people had so much faith in Moses. But when the Lord called Moses home, God told Joshua, As I was with Moses, if you trust me and obey me, I will also be with thee. I will raise you up in the sight of the people. If we are faithful to God, he promises to be faithful to us. He tells Moses, be strong and of good courage. He tells Joshua, be strong and of good courage. Thus concludes the outline of the book of Joshua.